Not this one. Not even this one. Oh. This? Not even this one. Is it really that hard to find pride nowadays? Ugh. Only because I'm a psychopath and not interested in sexual intercourses does not mean that I'm not interested in romance. Every man or woman that have contacted me only asked about it. How many men can you take at once? How many years of experience do you have in that sector? A virgin? Is it a trap to flag to virgins? Why can't the succubus want to live as a normal human girl? <sighs> Jeez. Not even my sisters believe me. They just think that's a new way of hunting of virgins. Not even for bitches is so hard. Then why it's so difficult for me? Oh. Another match? Let's have a look. What kind of profile picture would have this one? Hmm, this Instagram looks like all the others, so... Let's see... It's him! The one guy from the same maths class with me. Huh, strange. I've never thought of you as someone using this kind of site. He seemed the stereotype of a shy nerdy guy. <laughs> well, he is. Wait, this is not a joke, right? He... His profile description is the same as me. Well, <laughs> same as me if I was a guy, but still. Maybe... Hmm. Well, let's just try. This way. Um, hello? Do you remember me? I'm in the same math class as you. Please don't be afraid of me being a succubus. <laughs> I see that we have a lot of things in, in, in common. And maybe we could have a proper chat. If yes, feel free to call me smiling emoji. We are in this same classroom chat. It won't be difficult. I hope to have not been too much aggressive. Only Belzebu knows that I would never be able to talk like that to him in person. I'm not like my sister who got that job as a detective with no problem. Talk about her. Where is she? Was she supposed to come back a while ago? It's raining cats and dogs out there. Oh, he... he actually answered. No, wait. He wanted me to... Blood's up? He's asking if it was me the one that wrote to him on Tinder. Well, no, I don't have to step back. Especially right now. Here I go, so nothing. Hi, yes, it was me. I've seen your profile and never I would have thought of you having so many things in common with me. No joke. Maybe we can talk about it sometimes. I'm keen to know more about you. Okay, and send. Whew, now I just have to wait and... He's not really calling me. Okay, um, I didn't expect it to happen. Uh, that the listen so quickly though. Okay, okay, keep it cool, keep it cool. Even if you're a virgin, you're still a... a... Oh, fuck it. Uh, hi, how are you doing? Me? Oh, well, I mean... For starters, <laughs> why did you make the profile? Never would I have thought of you. Oh, you you wanted to try there too, huh? Wait, what do you mean with there too? Oh, you're you're still a, uh, oh, not just a virgin, you say? Oh, <laughs> you have never been in a relationship. I, I see. No, no, don't apologize. I mean, um, have you read my profile on that site, did you? No, it was no lie. Hmm, well, it's so hard to believe that a succubus is not interested in sex, huh? <laughs> I just want a damn hug. <laughs> Why can't two people be in a sex-based relationship? <laughs> I hate this stupid 
black wings of mine. I had this long tail, this reddish skin. I had myself as whole. Why couldn't I have been born as normal human girl? I, I, what, what do you mean? Uh, no, no, don't, don't try to say that you like me. What? No, I'm, I'm just a, even, if I don't want to. This is the body of a whore, and, and. Well, if, if I remember the letter that was in my locker last semester, uh, of course. No, no, don't you just say that. And why did you never ask me out then? No, no, I, I. <sighs> Listen, being a good student doesn't mean that I was uninterested in romance and stuff like that. I. <sighs> Why don't we have hang out instead of speaking through a phone? <laughs> it would be funnier. Yes, good. <laughs> I mean, uh, not to seem a proper, but you don't live too far from a house, do you? Mm. Would you, would you like to hang out at my house? Please don't think anything of duty. I just want to talk. No ulterior motives. It will be here in fifteen minutes. Great. I I'll be waiting for you. See ya. Hi. So you truly came after all. No, I'm I'm not saying that you were lying, but but this is the first time I ever happened to be in a situation like this. Oh yes, my parents are out for work and my sister should have should have been home a long time ago, but sent me a message saying that she would have been at one of her colleagues' house, so oh, it's not important right now. Here, have a towel. It's raining cats and dogs out there, isn't it? It's the heaviest rain since last year, isn't it? What? No, I'm... I'm not trying to buy some time. Is it so evident that I'm nervous? Well, of course, I am... Oh, you too? Well, so... Wanna talk about it? So, why... Why have you written the letter in the first place? Did you really mean what was written on it? If... If I read it... Oh, of course! Uh, also, I should have it here. Um, look, is it... No? I still have difficulties believing it, but... I've never heard of you lying so, or you are the master of lying, or you... So, you meant every word that was written on it. Well, if that's the case, may, may I ask you a favor? What kind of, uh, well, I, I would like for you to read it, please. Not brave enough, please don't say that. Um, then I will read it myself, and, and after I've been done so, you will repeat it. Deal? Good, okay. Um, too sorry, I'm not brave enough to talk to you in person, but trying to write down my feelings on this piece of paper is the least I can do. Sorry, you're always open to talk with anyone who asks something to you. You're both beautiful and a good person, with the addition of even being good in every subject. <laughs> Sorry, even if I know that there will never be a single chance for me, I wanted to say that I like you. A lot. So, from your face, I can see that it was truly you, the one who wrote it. But please! May... 
May you tell me that you... What? What have I just said? No, please, please, repeat it. You... You love me. You, you love me? Love me? You love my voice? My personality? <laughs> I... It's just that... I love you too. I love you too. <laughs> Hey, no, no, please keep going. It tastes really sweet. You, you want to caress my horns? I, I, y yes, of course. I just, please, please, be gentle. They're still growing and they're really sensitive. Uh, it feels relaxing. Oh, mm. and your hands, your hands are really warm and soft. I, <laughs> I wasn't expecting it from a man, to be completely honest. We were always being told that men are only and always thinking about doing things, but you and me, we are not that different, are we? <laughs> uh, mm, mm. So maybe if. If, if it is of not too much trouble to you, now that the storm has finished, would you, would you like to go and have an ice cream with me? You do. Uh, thank you. And oh, of course, we, we can hold hands here. Um, let's go to eat a good ice cream. What? No, no, don't misunderstand it. It was just improvised. So let's have our first date, my new boyfriend. <laughs>